Hello! Welcome back from our Hogwarts legacy. We have an angry Sebastian in the background once again. If you forgot from last time, we went to Feldcroft and there was this whole fiasco that happened with Anne where he used a... one of the unfor... What, I don't remember what they're called. One of the curses, whatever, that everyone's like, oh my god, dark magic, blah, 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 that whole thing. So yes, um, with that little recap done, we are going to see where we left off and continue on. Oh, I didn't realize that Poppy called us. Okay, we're going to do that because there was another thing at the beginning of the episode. We went to give the dragon egg back with Poppy and she ran away quite quickly. Where the, how do I get out of here? Over here. She ran away quite quickly and I had a sneaky suspicion that it's because sh she was thinking something happened with her grandma. I think it's her grandma. I don't know why this is not letting me out. Hello? Can I get out, please? There we go. Jeez Louise. Um, something happened with her grandma where she, like, wasn't... I, like, didn't answer an hour or something like that? I don't know. But... I don't know. I'm starting to really enjoy Poppy, and I'm gonna be upset if something happened to her grandma. So I am very curious what is going on. What I'm betting is that the poachers are like, oh, we gotta hit her where it hurts, and her grandma was that person. Well, I think, isn't it true that her grandma was doing- is it actually her grandma? Now I don't remember if it was her grandma or not. I might just be sounding crazy saying that. But I'm pretty sure sh whoever this lady is was doing research on different creatures. So either way, I feel like it, as bad as it sounds, it makes sense for the poachers to want to kind of go after this lady, you know? Hopefully she's good, but I am almost betting. What just happened? Rebellion. Rebellion. Ah. I don't know if that's what it wanted me to find, but apparently something funky was going on. Okay, what's happening? What is- what is making that noise? Is it the ghosts? Oh, could it be that? I don't think it was... I don't know, we're gonna keep going. What do you want? Why are you just out here? Okay. Let's wait for Poppy, see what's going oh, good, down. Safe. I'm safe? What do you- oh yeah. What do you mean? There you are. You were in such a state when you left. The poachers got to my gran. <gasps> Someone recognized me in Hauntel Hall and they got to her. What do you mean? Is she all right? She's fine, thank goodness. But they were at her house. Our house. They assumed I'd sent the egg there. She oh. said they took the whole place apart looking for it, screaming that we cost them everything. Um, I, okay. she said she was fine, though. I'm sorry, Poppy. I'm glad she's all right. I don't think either one of us could have anticipated that. I should have known. I underestimated the poachers. And now another creature's in danger. Huh? What do you mean? The poachers refused to leave empty-handed, so they took valuable journals oh that Gran discovered when she was researching rare creatures. One of them contained theories about a secret hiding place of the <gasps> Snidget, Snidget. one thought to be extinct. <gasps> Exactly what kind of creature is a Snidget? It's a small bird with golden feathers. It's incredible. It has rotational wings that allow it to dart quickly in any direction. In fact, the golden snitch in uh -huh. Quidditch is based on the Snidget, which barbarically was actually used oh. in the sport hundreds of years ago. Oh, oh, okay. Why would Snidgets be valuable to poachers? They could make more money with Snidgets than they ever would have fighting dragons. The golden Snidget's feathers and eyes are incredibly valuable. That's why they're believed to be extinct. They were hunted out of existence by wizard kind. If the poachers found some now, I can't bear to think about the horrific way they'd be bred and killed for profit. Yikes. Where exactly are these Snidgets allegedly hidden? Gran says the journals were a bit cryptic, which is good. Perhaps the poachers won't be clever enough to find the birds. From what she recalls, the journals only noted that the key to finding them lay in the moonlight. Gran thinks it can be narrowed down to a handful of locations. Okay, so this is either either going to turn into 
us having to fight the poachers because they're there and they just found it. Or it's going to be we have to try and find it before they get to them. I take it you aren't going to let the poachers anywhere near the Snidgets. Gran wants me to stay out of it. But I know she's devastated that poachers might go after the Snidgets if they still exist. They do, let's be real. We had the element of surprise on our side when we saved that dragon. But the poachers will be watching for us now. We need allies. Others who hate the poachers enough to help us. <gasps> who value creatures as much Merlin's as... beard! You're a genius! The centaurs! <gasps> they'd want the Snidgets protected at all costs. I don't necessarily think that's where my girl was going with this, but yes, I'm down. Sounds as if we need to go and talk to the centaurs. We'll need to be careful in how we approach them. Tensions with them are high. Still, I think they may be our only hope. Let me think on it. Think on it? Girl, how long do we have to find you know them? As soon as I have a plan. I'm gonna be in the middle of another dang thing and she's gonna say something. I swear, girl, if I walk away and you immediately call me, you should have just told me then. Okay, well, I'm gonna make a quick pit stop to the room of requirement and get any of our hidden thingy majiggies or gear stuff. And then I'm gonna go and sell the ones I don't need because I'm. We got a lot going on. And then we'll pick it up where we left off. Now, what are those? <laughs> okay, I feel like we've had a lot of Sebastian recently. So we are gonna do the Lodgok quest where we have to go bring a meat. And he's gonna speak some gobbledygook, apparently. Whatever. Whoa, he just scooted past me so quick. Okay, let's go speak to him. Hello. Hello there. Hello, Amit. Do I recall you saying that you speak gobbledygook? My, my eyes. I, I, I do. Speak it. Is this to do with the goblin I saw you with in Hogsmeade? It is. Um. His name is Logcock. We could use your help with something. He's waiting for me near a goblin mine. Would you be willing to help? Of course! How exciting! I mean, well, might this be dangerous? I think he simply wants to show me something that involves gobbledygook. If it helps, he's a friend of Serona's. Good to hear. Good to hear. If Serona trusts him, then I feel much better. He is a little scared, but, you know, he's got the spirit. You said you know gobbledygook, but how well? I've been reading it for as long as I've been reading English. My parents have an extensive library. Oh. Once I grew bored with the classics, I devoured goblin writings. I'd tell you some titles, but you wouldn't understand them. Yeah, probably have you right. Have ever spoken directly to a goblin? Unbelievably, no. I'm so looking forward to it. Actually conversing in gobbledygook with a native speaker. Cannot wait to confirm subtle bits of pronunciation and tone that may have eluded me. Being self-taught and all. Why do I have a feeling Lodgok doesn't actually know how to speak it? <laughs> and like, that's why we need the meat. Lodgok is waiting. Shall we go? Of course. I just want to check the pronunciation of a couple of key terms first. So I will meet you there. Somehow, he's still gonna beat me. Always does. Okay, let's see. Whoa, this music is going wild. Where do I have to go for this? Oh... Oh my god, I have never gone that far before. Okay, we got a little bit of a trek to make. Okay. Hey. A friend who speaks gobbledygook is meeting us. Before he arrives, perhaps you could tell me why we're here. Of course. Unfortunately, presenting Ranrock with the helmet of Earthbot did not have the effect I'd hoped. We saw that because coming. Because he knew the details surrounding its plunder, he presumed I'd had help from a witch or wizard in retrieving it. Oh. <laughs> How else did he expect Goblin Kind to get the helmet back? Seems he has no interest in making amends with you. I'm afraid we do not have the luxury of rational expectation when it comes to Ranrock. Damn Bragbore and his blasted journals. Bragbore? An ancestor of Ranrock's, renowned metal worker. If we are to work together, I suppose I must tell you more. Not long ago, Ranrock sent me to collect a recently unearthed set of Bragbore's journals. They Wait. described repositories that Bragbore had been commissioned to build for a group of witches and wizards. What do you mean, repositories? Large, magically fortified receptacles crafted from goblin metal. Ranrock recruited others to help me locate the repositories. 
We were to search anywhere that was connected to five names mentioned in the journals. Rackham, Fitzgerald, Bacar, Morganock, and Rookwood. Rookwood Castle? That is where we began our search. Why does Renrock care so much about these repositories? He cares about what they contain. For centuries, wizards have refused to share their magical knowledge with goblins. <laughs> Your kind will not even let us carry wands. Thus, many goblins, myself included, have spent our lives mistrusting wizard kind. Ranrock was convinced that the repositories contained a magical power that wizards wanted to keep for themselves. He was, is, determined to take it for goblin kind. But he's... Here comes my friend Amit. Probably best to continue our conversation later. Oh, greetings, Lord Cock. It is an honor, sir. You speak gobbledygook. <laughs> Oh, Enough. Please do not tell me oh, that was no. meant to be gobbledygook. I am. Um, well, yes. Perhaps my pronunciation was a bit off. I imagine certain dialects differ. Pronunciation is not the issue. I barely recognize that as language. I trust you can read gobbledygook better than you can speak it? I can. Sir Lodcock. Just Lodcock. <laughs> Thankfully, we only need someone who can decipher written plans, since I cannot join you in the mine. What written plans? And why can't you come with us? We need some idea of what Ranrock knows or is plotting. I suspect a careless loyalist may have left plans behind. And I'm unable to join you because I cannot risk anyone reporting my presence to Ran. All you need to do is not be seen. Either by the eye above the enchanted door or a loitering loyalist. Oh boy. What else should we know about the enchanted door? The door will not open while the eye can see you. You and your friend must be invisible to it to gain access. Okay. From what I know of wizard magic, that shouldn't be too difficult to achieve. No, I think... I think I can manage. I'll meet and I can do this. I will await your return. I'm nervous. I feel like something's gonna I go shall wrong. see you soon. Do I need to talk to either of you or can I just go? I'm gonna assume we can just go. The door is looking oh. at us. Oh! at sneaking about you'll see well hopefully you're better at sneaking than you are at speaking that okay let's get in here so i'm assuming this is going to be an entire sneaky thing he's like home oh. okay we got this books so rarely prepare one for reality Lumos. a real <laughs> goblin mind it's even grander than i had expected Okay, they told me I needed to be sneaky, or they. Lodgok told me I needed to be sneaky, so I'm staying sneaky. Now, how much you want to bet there's friggin' spiders? Ew, there's rats. I'd take rats over spiders, though. I cannot believe I met a goblin. Okay, you need to chill. Let's just learn what we can and get out. Yes. Look at this lift. Impressive workmanship for so simple. Shush. Impressive workmanship aside. The only way forward. I feel like he's gonna give us away. He's gonna be blah, 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 blah. Where are you? I was like, um. <laughs> I still can't believe we're inside a real goblin mine. Dude. I'm not going to invite you to any other thing. What did I just do? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, that was just a little secret. Okay, bet. Continuing on. Okay. I've read about mines like this, <gasps> but seeing one is something else altogether. It's not actually annoying. He's like geeking out about it. It's more of that Lodgok said we need to be careful and sneaky, need whatever. To be careful. 
As I'm sure you know, not all goblins are as friendly as Lodgog, to say the least. Uh-oh. Okay, this is where this might get a little fishy. Watch your step round here. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, don't worry. I got this. It's gonna hopefully go a bit smoother than that. Okay, I'm assuming. Okay, bruh. We're gonna go back to being sneaky. We won't get through as long as we can be seen by that eye. Yeah, I know. Okay. I feel like a character from one of the adventure books I read during the summer holidays. You're chatty, aren't you? Let's take a look around, Amit. See if we can find any plans. Yeah. Bound to be plans around here somewhere. A schematic. They're building something. I can't quite make it out. Curious. Let me know if you see any more plans or schematics. We can't return to Lodgok empty-headed. I know. I've been through this before, bro. See, this is the thing. I never know which way is the, like, main way. We're gonna go down here first. I'm trying to avoid those dudes as long as I can. Or maybe that's, like, the extra one. Nah, we're gonna go upstairs. <laughs> Holy... A meat. <laughs> Stop. Oh. That went way better than last time. Gotta say. Fascinating to see gobbledygook written in a goblin hand. The flourishes are extraordinary. There okay. must be more notes around here. What could they be building? I don't know. Oh, there is a lot of people in there. If I'm translating this correctly, and I think that I am, they're building something rather large. But what? I will um, get to the bottom of what they've been building down here. Um. I'm gonna be real here. I don't know what they could be building. Woo! Okay, this is gonna be a little fishy. Let's, let's, let's. Ooh. Oh my god. Okay, we're gonna stay right here. And now we're gonna do a little. Choosh. Woof. Okay, did that. And I'm gonna. Uh, I think this one. Oh my god. Not me. I don't exist. I don't know what you're talking about. You don't see anything. Now. Uh, no. I promise I'm not real. Ready, ready, ready. Hey. <laughs> okay, and I th think you're the last one. Oh, this really is too much. Bro. Stay close. <laughs> much worse. Yeah, I'm like, Another you've boiler. seen nothing. Another schematic. What are they going to build? This mine is too small for whatever it is. Um. I am curious. What, like, I, I don't get it. Um. Where do I go? 
Oh. I totally missed that. Anyways. Devil snare. <gasps> Nasty stuff if we're not careful. Not an entanglement we need right now. Lumos. Yeah, get out of my way. Why did I not do this sneakily? Oh. <laughs> ah ha ha. I am just trying to be able to use stupefy. I was gonna just try and stupefy him, but like, he's not giving me really anything to work with here. Get him on me. Oof. How many of them are there? Dude. That should be the last of them, Amit. This guy. That was really fun. I'm really, really glad I did not sneak that. For sure. Totally. <sighs> if any of you couldn't tell, that was sarcasm. I don't know. I'm I'm starting to think I don't care about the little challenges they give me for a fight. It would have been so much easier to sneak. Oh, I just got whacked with the door. No. Light on fire. Is this the big secret? This is oh. not good. They're building enormous oh. drills. Bigger than this mine could contain. What is Let's get out of here and tell Lord Gok what we found. What does that mean, though? There must be a quicker way out of here than retracing our steps. Um. Possibly. I don't know how, though. Ah! It's called an elevator. That would do it. I'm very glad the game told me that, because I would have walked through the entire thing. I need a moment to catch my breath. This was more than I bargained for. Bro, this wasn't even bad. Me, now that we know what they're up to, we can get out of here. Bro, you need to get out of Hogwarts more. Like, don't get me wrong, this probably is kind of spooky if you've been only doing astronomy things but okay let's make our way back to Lodcock now we're almost out of here Amit look the lift why do I feel like something's gonna happen I feel like something's gonna go wrong before we can leave are we good are we good <laughs> The game's never that nice. Oh! Look at that. Okay, let's see here. I feel like he's gonna be like... Can we please talk about what just happened? Yeah, man's is losing his mind. That wasn't so bad, was it? It was. It really <laughs> was. I'm afraid I've had enough adventure for one day. For a lifetime, perhaps. Thank you, Amit. I couldn't have done it without you. Now, if you don't mind, I'd like to have a word with Lord Cock. Understood? I'll leave you to it. Your goblin secrets are safe with me, but I get to write the book about this escapade someday. Have at it. I am fine. Without further ado, at you. Are you just gonna poof out of nowhere? No, apparently not. Okay, well, he's just, he's walking back. He's like, peace out, psycho. Okay, well, let's get this over with. He's probably gonna be like, oh my goodness gracious. This is so bad. Oops. Hopefully no one needed those buckets. Hey. They're building enormous drills. We found their plans. Ranrock must be searching for the repositories. I fear you are correct. Other than Rookwood Castle, however, I do not know where else he plans to search. Hmm. I've been wondering about something else you said before we entered the mine. Yes? 
If you share Ranrock's views, then why are you helping me? I oh. expected Rookwood Castle to be deserted when I arrived to begin my search. So was surprised to find a witch there who had set up a sort of improvised research site. What? She was studying something so intently that she almost didn't notice me. When she looked up, I thought she would react with fear or disdain. But instead, she did something that I will never forget. Without a moment's hesitation, she smiled and asked me to sit with her. Okay. She told me that she was a researcher and showed me a small, oddly shaped container with a strange symbol on it. She was certain it was made <gasps> of goblin metal, but was unable to open it. Oh, she wait. She wanted to work together. Miriam. Yeah. Yes. But how did Professor you... Professor Fig's wife. He told me of her research, and I know of the container. Oh. oh. The reverence with which she talked of goblins oh. and their intelligence and skill, it caught me entirely off guard. I'd never been treated with such respect by a witch or wizard. So, to my surprise, I let her study the container if she would allow me to search the castle on my own. We parted ways, with her promising to share what she'd learned. More of Ranrock's recruits arrived, and we began to dig, eventually locating the first repository. Ranrock was thrilled with our discovery, but furious when I told him about Miriam. Berated me for trusting a witch, and I heard she had been killed. You think Ranrock murdered her? I don't want to believe it, but I don't know. After that, something shifted in me. I had seen how the power from the repositories was transforming Ranrock, transforming all of them. I could no longer remain a part of it. Thank you, Lord Gog, for telling me this. Mm. I tell you all of this so that you understand what is at stake. <sighs> Ranrock never found all of Bragbor's journals, but the ones he did find suggest that Bragbor, at some point, built a repository far greater in size than the one beneath Rookwood Castle. What you've discovered here today worries me deeply. If Ranrock learns of the location of that repository, I fear we shall be destined for a great war. Oh no, that's gonna be how this ends, I isn't it? I will find out what Ranrock knows. Watch for my owl. He seems weird. Like, something just changed within him. <laughs> I did not think that this story was going to connect in that way. I I don't know why, but... Oh, jeez Louise, I don't know why that scared me. I don't know, I guess I never anticipated, like, Fig connecting to this half of the story. Other than being like, oh, we need to go to this, you know, whatever. Okay, well that was different than what i was expecting there but okay cool the next one wow this is the only time in a long time that we've only had three things going on <laughs> Ooh, i have not been paying attention to finding those moons at some point i almost want to just i feel like honestly what i should do sometime is when i have some extra time i should stream and we can focus only on like the little extra things not like any of the actual quest quests but like finding all the moons running through the castle finding the dedalian keys doing like the merlin trials and little things like that stuff that doesn't really like affect the story story leaving all that to the videos so if you made it this far in the video and you hear this let me know your thoughts on that i'm not gonna give you a guaranteed time or whatever when that would happen if you agree with that but it's definitely a thought that maybe I could do because sometimes I feel like that's just not interesting enough to put in like a video, you know? Most of the time I cut all that out anyways. I don't know the last time I included that in a video, but anywho, now that we're done with that, next thing we have to do is meet Sebastian. 
I am very curious to see what this is going to lead to. I, I, something to do with Anne, I'm pretty sure. Holy, we have to go all the way up here. Oh, hey. I have a flu flame. I'm a bit nervous how this is going to go. Because the last time we had to do stuff with Sebastian, it turned into a whole fiasco. Oh, it's nighttime for this I one. I my owl might pique your interest. Hey. I came as soon as I could. I'd been so preoccupied by all that happened with Ominous and the catacomb, not to mention my uncle's reaction, that I'd almost forgotten what it was that struck me about that triptych. This is the view painted on the canvas that was left on it. That's incredible. You know this area well. And while I was waiting for you, I scouted around and discovered an abandoned mine nearby, surrounded by Ranrock's loyalists. Do you think there's a connection to the triptych? I've no idea, but perhaps they're searching it, the way they did Brookwood Castle and Isadora's Manor. How do we want to handle this? Um, I am a big fan of the sneak recently, so we're gonna go with that. We need to see what they're doing, but let's not draw their attention. Very well. And I still have that rune symbol we found on the triptych. If there is a connection, I suspect we'll see that symbol again. Okay, so what is this? Oh, oh, okay. I'm going first. What is this? I, um... I don't really know what to expect with this, I'm gonna be honest. There they are. Up oh. Ahead. oh. I'll let you lead. Well, I said sneak, so I'm sneaking. I don't know about you, but... Hey, guys. No Kill anyone who tries. Well, I fear... Loyalists are out for blood. Yeah, and guess what? Dead. <laughs> Nothing. Whoa! Okay, I did not think he was gonna turn around like that. <laughs> We're gonna go this way. Going backwards. Boom. Mwahaha! Okay. Up. Someone there. No. Killed it. Oh my gosh, I did so good. Is that all of them? So far, I guess. Honestly, I feel like that's the smoothest I've done a sneaky one. <laughs> Usually there's at least one that spots me, but that was pretty dang good if you ask me. I don't really know how sneaky I gotta be. Like, can I run here, or are they gonna spot me? This is going well. I agree. We make a good team. We do at that. Think Sebastian. You know, I'm gonna be honest Once though. Again, we could fight our way through, or we'll be discreet. You know which one I'd choose. Yeah, and guess what, Sebastian? Every single time we use your way, Bring it gets us into trouble. I'll take them all. Run the other way when they see me, humans do. Every time. Sure, buddy. Sure. <laughs> okay, what is the best way? Ooh. The wizards will be defeated. Okay, this one is a little bit funkier. I kind of just want to pop out when he gets close and be like, Mwahaha. Let's do it. Now. What was that? Poof! <laughs> Nothing? Going for it. Yeah! Oh my god, please stop looking at me. Please stop looking at me. We're just gonna sneak right up in this one's face. <laughs> okay. And boom. Killed it. Is that all of them? Uh, apparently not. I just saw another thing f flash. Whoa. Oh my god, he's in the corner. I'm blind. And the fun is Ooh. over. Fun is a relative term. <laughs> it is. And that was relatively fun. Sebastian, why are you weird? 
Like this dude is just odd. I should tell you. Rumor is this mine was closed long ago due to an <sighs> infestation of spiders. Mm. How nice. Nothing I haven't seen before. <sighs> yeah, I've That's been the spirit. Mm. I've been seeing way too many spiders. Oh my god. I really hate this game. I really some days I regret touching this. I thought I was about to get out of this episode, not having to touch a single spider. It was going to be great and lovely. No. Sebastian has to ruin my entire day. Oh, there's a dead one right there. Is there... We're making quick progress. No. I haven't even made it in yet. Oh my god, there's dead spiders everywhere. Why does that one look fake? <laughs> Did I just <laughs> I love this game. It let me go all the way back around <laughs> and out of the spider den just for me to have to go right back in. This is stupid. Now, can it just be the little spiders and not like the big giant ones? Because <sighs> I feel like this game makes me sound like a crybaby. Okay. How spidery is this gonna be? Oh. Hold on. As a grave. Yes. For better or for worse, we're in. Ah. Maybe because they're here, there's gonna be like no spiders. And I'll get lucky. <laughs> Odds of that? This probably looks like a tomb. Pretty it was closed after accidents were reported. It's it. Why? Yeah. Whoa, I almost did not make that. Mm. Smash, I'm scared. I just would like to let you know. Oh. Oh, those are people? Oh. Uh. Oh, I just almost knocked Sebastian. <laughs> My bad, bro. I don't see any goblins in these webs. Too disgusting for even a spider to prey on. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. That sounded so dramatic, but that was my actual reaction. Sebastian, you better help. Oh. Well. Didn't let me be sneaky there. <laughs> I want to use one of my cool ones. Get him. Is he gonna do it? Oh. So is he just like there now? Am I good? Okay. <gasps> oh, no, he comes back. They do indeed come back. <laughs> How many Rambox loyalists are in here? Too many. Uh -huh. They definitely think there's something here they want. Yeah, um... Do I have to go that way, or can I go this that way? Is awfully high. Any ideas? Yes, actually. Oh. Does that work? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna go this way, because it says I'm supposed to go that way, so this way feels like a secret. Oh! Yay, there's little spiders. Ah! Okay, I'm out. Oh, wait. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Hey, y'all. It's no wonder spiders oh. give people food. It could be the hairy legs, or the solar eyes, or the venomous fangs, or any number of endearing qualities, really. Sebastian, you are talking a lot, and you're saying a lot of things I'm not liking, so... I just a little piece of advice maybe shush thankfully there has been less spiders so far than I was anticipating but I am uh, something tells me there's still gonna be a big old spider by the end of this Whee. Smashing. <laughs> your stairs. funny that bridge has seen better days. Yeah. Repair it. Yay. Oh, 
Beautiful. Uh oh. <gasps> what? Oh my god, it's the evil thing. How? Oh, oh, slay. Oh my god, there's another one. Huh? Okay. Um, that was not great. I mean, that was a lot easier than I thought it'd be. I'm wondering, was that spider what killed all of these? Or are you a dude or are you a goblin? I'm really nervous We're for this. We're making quick work of them. Professor yeah? Heather would be proud. She would at that. Ramrock's loyalists all but declared war. Lumos. Lumos. Mm hmm. Can you let me in, please? What is up here? Incendio. Ah! Oh, this is a big chest. Okay, let's get this over with. <laughs> ah! Oh my god. Thanks, Sebastian. Did not know that was there. Yippee! Hmm. How much you want to bet there's a spider fight? Part of me feels like there won't be because there's so many of his goblin dudes. We've still not seen a single rune for them. I know. I think we're going to be a bit distracted from runes for a moment. An unwelcome distraction at that. <laughs> Why is he? We have another fight on our hands. Why am I not surprised? Yeah. I wouldn't give for a cup of mushroom tea. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Oh my god, now there's spiders. Oh my god, it's a giant one. Ah, ah. Why is there so many? Ooh. Yes! Not gonna lie, this is one of my favorite things to do now. Oh, ow. Oof. We certainly cleared the room. Don't know why Gryffindors get credit for bravery. We Slytherins are teeming with it. <laughs> We're much more fun to fight with. Okay, bro. Just because you like to use the unforgivable stuff doesn't necessarily mean it's fun. No. Oh. Peace. Oh, yeah. Peace for long. Uh -huh. Sebastian, do you know what kind of game we're playing? Oh, I cannot make it up there. Ah, it's because of this. Mm. Above the cabin door. Ranrock's loyalists never knew to look for it. Okay. Find a couple more rooms. Incendio. Well, I found one. Can you hit that? Wasn't expecting Sheesh. that. What do you mean? I feel like that was pretty obvious. So, uh, there's probably gonna be spiders still. What is this? What what's happening? Sebastian, oh. I think I found something. A canvas okay. piece. Brilliant. Our efforts weren't in vain after all. Still, oh. something about this place feels odd. Okay. 
The world floated back to me as if in a watery haze. How long had I, had I been unconscious? I only remember his eyes, empty, empty of sorrow, yes, but also. I recall feeling a sense of euphoria as I watched the pain vanish, but then everything started to turn. When I fell, I must have hit my head. I neither feel nor... I neither feel nor see a mark, but the pain is throbbing. I can only hope it's not the Black Death. At least he's no longer in pain. Oh. What do you have there? A journal entry by Isadora. Hopefully it will help us unravel more of this mystery. Okay. If the triptych led us here to find this bit of canvas, we can probably assume that Isadora Morganark was here. She seems to have been everywhere. But if she was using the Undercroft and the cellar beneath her manor in Feldcroft, why would she create this space? And why hide it behind cryptic rune symbols and ancient magic that no one but you could see? Isadora and Percival Rackham, another of the Keepers, could see traces of ancient magic too. Rackham? I haven't heard his name before. Here's are some of the memories I've seen. I don't think he and Isadora saw eye to eye on how this magic should be used. Well, this is all rather baffling. <laughs> Let's take the canvas back to the triptych. Perhaps the answers are there. Okay. This place is odd, to be sure, but I'm fascinated by it. Now, for the trek back out oh. of here and to Hogwarts. Unless we can find another passageway to the Undercroft. Are you for real? Let's have a look around. No way. Why does everything lead to the freaking Undercroft? I feel like there's something I don't remember about the Undercroft. And now for it the has to fit. Truth. Oh... Okay, this isn't what I meant about me forgetting things about the Undercroft, but I did forget this existed. I just meant, why does it lead to so many different places? Or like, why do so many places lead to it? Please tell me you recognize the location in this bit of canvas. The good news is I do, in fact. Of course he does. And the bad news? We're in for more trouble. Oh no. What? I know that coast. Ranrock has taken over a huge mine in the surrounding area. Mar and Weem has suffered for it. It's as bad as Feldcroft's become. Should we head there now? We should wait. Why? All this time, we've been a step behind Ranrock. I may know someone who could help us get ahead. Lord who Gok? is that? <gasps> okay, he did ask me to not say anything, so I'm not going to tell him. But I feel like everything is coming together. Someone who knows Ranrock personally. They asked me not to mention their name to anyone. A goblin? Tell me I'm wrong. You know goblins cursed my sister to shut her up. Said she should be seen and not heard. I do, but not all goblins. Not all goblins what? Oh my god. Have you forgotten, Feldcroft? Have you forgotten the mine we just went through? No, Sebastian, I haven't. You're not listening to me. Why would I listen to someone so ignorant? Oh. Perhaps your uncle was right about you. You don't know when to stop. Oh, I do know when to stop. Unbelievable. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, I feel like this just got a little bit more interesting. I... Okay. I'm honestly kind of glad I didn't mention his name. Oh. I believe my next broom upgrade to be even more impressive than the last. Come by Spin Witches as soon as you can. Ooh. I totally forgot about that, honestly. Oh, it wants me to speak to someone in the portal room. What all did it give me? Okay. Okay, so this is the next keeper trial then. Right. I want to know what happened to Poppy. Well, we're going to save the next Keeper Trial until next episode. Just because we're kind of already at the, the time we usually are. We did the side quest with Poppy, talking to her, yada yada, whatever. And we did both of the main quests today. So, again, let me know what you guys think about doing like little streams to catch up on the Dalian Keys and the Moon quests. Otherwise, I'm probably just going to do it off camera at some point just because I mean unless you guys really want to see it but I personally don't see the point of including all of that in the videos just because I feel like there's more interesting things to do you know or better ways to spend our time but I'm 
almost certain next episode, Sebastian's going to come around and be like, I'm sorry, but there was no way I was going to not tell him that that was cruel because that was mean. <laughs> I didn't even do anything. But yeah, with that, we're going to leave it here. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you next week for more Hogwarts Legacy. Bye.